So I wanted to design some aerodynamic shapes that are similar to a raindrop. And one of the main problems of using a white reference in Katia Imagine and Shape is the following. So as we see over here, those control points for the subdivision are white. So it's really hard to see if they are selected or not when you try to design something. So you can change this within Katia options. If you're gonna go up to tools, options, we need to select the shape category because imagining and shape is underneath shape. And over here, we're gonna have the base mesh. So this color will control that one. For example, I can make it blue. I will click OK. And as soon as I will press space to enter edit mode, we are gonna see that our new color will be blue. So this will be a lot more easier to, to work with. You can change any color that you, that you want. You can also change the thickness of the line. So by default, it's set to one where we have the value of 0 0.30 millimeters. If you want to have those larger, you can set it to one. You can also change the symbol for the vertex or for the point. We can go for something like a cross. And now we're going to see we're going to have that cross point and the line will be thicker. But I recommend that you leave the default over here. So this will be the circle. And you also, if you also want to leave the color preset to white, one change that we can do is to have the image inverse. So we can do that with any, any software that can process images. For example, I make use of Irfan View, which is free. You can also use Photoshop or GIMP. So I will just open this and at the top we're going to have image and we're going to see negative invert image, all channels. That means that everything that will is currently black will be white and vice versa. And this is the result and we can just save this as a different name and we can replace the already positioned painting gallery photo, for example, painting one. I will double click this, this and we're going to see the location for the file and I already have the inverse generated so it will be this aero 2 I can just swap that and I can go back and uh, work using the standard color so where we're gonna have white for imagine and shape okay so I hope you find this kind of content uh, useful if so let me know in the comment section below thanks for watching